Hey y'all, thanks for watching. I'm Nicole Rogers, broker owner of First Class Real Estate Platinum. I've had an influx in buyers recently relocating here to Athens, Georgia from other parts of the US that have asked about the cost of living and things to do and what's great about Athens, Georgia. For that reason, today I'm gonna be discussing the cost of living in Athens, Georgia, covering everything from housing to utilities to even groceries. If you're interested in moving to Athens, Georgia, be sure to hit subscribe and follow. In the upcoming weeks, we're gonna be taking tours of the city. We're gonna be showing the properties that are available. And we're also gonna be giving the pros and cons of living in this area. Also, if you're interested in moving, please make sure to contact us in the information below, whether it be through call, email, text. Uh, that way we can help you make this transition to moving to Athens, Georgia as smooth as possible. That being said, let's get into all things cost. So the average cost in the United States currently is $374,900 for a home. Uh, in the state of Georgia, we're looking at $245,800. Here in Athens, you're looking around $227,000. That being said, there are multiple homes listed right now currently in this market that range from 40,000 to 3.7 million, depending on the area that you're in. In the upcoming weeks, we will be going into the different sections of Athens to talk about um, where the higher end homes are versus where the homes that more investors are geared towards. Uh, there, you do see a lot of investment properties here in Athens, Georgia, just because of University of Georgia. A lot of people buy homes to flip to the student population. In the last year alone, prices in Athens have gone up 1.4%, but I feel like that's kind of across the board as far as the housing market. We've seen an increase. Uh, the pandemic did hit the market in a different way than anybody thought it would. We are starting to see a shift in the market, which is great news for buyers. Uh, we're also seeing a shift in the rental market in Athens as well. That being said, rentals in Athens currently range from $925 to $2,500. There's a big gap in the market in rentals just because we are near UGA and UGA does obviously bring the student population. With the student population, those rental prices are based per room, not per house. So it kind of varies in that respect. Um, the utilities here in Athens, for a 900 square foot apartment, you're looking at around 206 a month. Uh, but in the larger homes where you've got like 2,300 square feet, for example, we live in a 2,300 square feet home, we're paying on average around 400 a month. So that's gonna cover your electric bill, your trash, and your water bill for the month. Internet price is averaging around $68 a month. We personally pay 69. Obviously that's gonna vary based on what you're needing internet for, if you're, the higher speeds obviously for streaming and business and things like that, they're gonna cost a little bit more. You can also still get basic plans, I think that fall around 30 to $40 a month. So it all just depends on what you're needing the internet for. As far as cable goes, we personally don't have cable at our home. We use streaming services. Uh, the streaming services stay pretty consistent regardless of location. But cable out here, it ranges from probably around that $70 mark up to however much you wanna add to your plan. The sales tax here in Georgia is 4%. Uh, Athens is another four. So for a total of 8% sales tax here in Athens, Georgia. So that's gonna give you another eight cents per dollar. For groceries here in Athens, you're looking at around $1,000 for a family of four. Obviously it depends on the amount of people in the home as to how much it's gonna cost. It's also gonna depend on which grocery store you go to. So Athens does have multiple options as far as grocery shopping. We have your bigger chains like Publix and Kroger and Aldi and Walmart. And then we also have your Fresh Market, your Earth Fair, um, and your more local butchers and delis. So it really just depends on which area you like to shop in and what you're actually looking for. Um, Fresh Market and Earth Fair are gonna offer you more of your organic options, whereas the Kroger and Publix are gonna give you more of your generic, what you see wherever you go regardless. Uh, gas prices currently are 280 a gallon for regular unleaded. 
and you're looking at around 320 per gallon for premium unleaded. But again, this is gonna depend more on where you get your gas. So Kroger, if you're a Kroger member, you're gonna get that amount off if you shop there. Uh, same with Sam's Club. Sam Club, Sam's Club also offers you uh, a discounted gas price for being a member. So it's gonna depend on where you're a member of and obviously your personal preference of where you wanna get your gas from. Your cost of entertainment here in Athens does tend to run on the lower side um, because it is a college town. Uh, you can get a beer here at the bar for $2 concert tickets for $10 up to $50 depending on location and venue. There are multiple venues to go out and see concerts and see music. You also have your art venues. Um, being a college town, it does offer a lot more options as far as entertainment and, and nightlife. Um, as far as going out to eat for one person, you're looking at around probably $10 to $15 for a meal. For a family of four, usually it falls closer to that $50 mark, depending on where you are. Uh, there are some restaurants that obviously are gonna be much higher end, whereas some restaurants you could probably eat for as cheap as $5, $6. It really just depends on what area you're in in Athens. Again, in the upcoming weeks, we are gonna go over different sections in different areas of Athens. We'll give you an idea of the different places that you can go, regardless of what you're, you're looking for or you're interested in, there's always plenty to do here in Athens. According to livingcost.org, we are ranked in the top 22% for best places to live in the world and we're ranked 439th best city in the United States. With an estimated population of 115,000, Athens is ranked 247th in the United States for largest cities, with the exception of game day, which tends to bring in around 30,000 more. So that pretty much sums up the cost of living here in Athens, Georgia. I hope that I was able to help with all the questions that you may have. If so, please make sure to hit like and hit subscribe and follow for the upcoming weeks. Again, we are gonna be going over the pros and cons of living here in Athens, Georgia. We're also gonna be taking tours of some of the beautiful properties that are available. And also we will go over just the places that there are to, to see, all the parks and all of the venues that you can visit. So please hit subscribe, make sure to follow us, and I look forward to meeting each and every one of you. Have a great day.